The Advanced Custom Fields plugin has been taken over by WordPress.org. From the 12th of October, they kind of forked and made almost a duplicate copied version of the ACF plugin. So when you now go to the WordPress repository and you search for Advanced Custom Fields, you're going to find Secure Custom Fields pop up. Now I want to make clear, what does this mean for you if you've got a current version or you go and install a new version? or you've got ACF Pro and the clarity is kind of already there on the screen, but I just want to quickly go through it. I also want to point out that I am not affiliated, sponsored by WP Engine. I don't use WP Engine hosting. The only thing that I use from them is ACF. So if anyone watching this thinks, oh, you're on their side, I'm not at all. I love WordPress, but I just want to clarify, what does this mean for you and your clients? So from 12th of October, WordPress.org went and forked their own version. And there's many debates and opinions about that. I don't want to get into the drama of it, but let's cut to the chase of what this means for you. If your website already has ACF Pro, you're already going to be getting your updates. And ACF Pro includes all of the components of ACF Free. So you won't need the ACF free version as a plugin on your website. You would already have Pro. You are still going to be getting all of the updates and it will still say ACF Pro. So you have nothing to worry about. But what about if your website hasn't got ACF Pro and you've got the free version? Now, the latest version at the time of recording for ACF free is version 6.3.8. If you have a version of ACF, which is less than 6.3.8, so you might have 6.3.6.1.2.5.8.3, if you've got a version less than 6.3.8, you will get a notification in your WordPress to go and do an update. You know, update available, update now. When you click that, ACF will change to become SCF or Secure Custom Fields and it will become version 6.3.6.2. Again, I don't want to get into the drama of it, but it's basically a copy. It will say there's 2 million installation. It's the same one of the versions from ACF that they had before 6.3.8. So technically, you're getting all of the ACF free. However, when you look at it carefully, not only will it still say ACF in the WordPress sidebar dashboard, which makes no sense, it will be missing the options setting or tab within ACF when you go to your sidebar. And when you are looking at your fields, you will now no longer have any pro fields. Now, if you're using ACF free and you weren't using pro fields, you're going to go, well, who cares? But in the original ACF free, you would have options like repeater fields, gallery fields and others. And it would say you could go and upgrade and the options tab in the WordPress sidebar that would allow you to go and upgrade. Now, if you have no intention of upgrading, you might go, well, hey, I don't care. I don't care if the name has changed. I'm going to continue using it. But bear in mind, the latest version of ACF is 6.3.8. So how do you get the latest version? Because at the moment, no matter how many times you hit update, you're not going to get it with SCF. The simple thing to do, and the link is in the video description, is go directly to the Advanced Custom Fields website. And in the bottom, in the footer, you will see a link that says download. And all you gotta do is click download ACF. You can click GitHub and go to the GitHub if you want, but just click download ACF and that will download 6.3.8. And all you then gotta do is go to your WordPress website, plugins, upload plugins, upload that zipped file, and boom, you are now back to ACF and you will now have the option to upgrade to Pro and you will now see that repeater fields are available, but you got to upgrade to Pro, but it basically puts you back to where you need to be. So remember, if you've got a version less than 6.3.8 and you go and update, it will become secure custom field. And I cannot predict if future updates will flow through. I don't know, that's between WP Engine and between WordPress. But WP Engine have kind of got you out of jail in a way because they have allowed you to go and download the latest versions. And each time they have an update, it will be in the footer of their website. But what about if you've got a brand new WordPress installation and you go and add a plugin? When you type advanced custom fields because you want to add it, you won't see it. What you will see is secure custom fields. Strangely, that's the one that pops up even though you typed advanced custom fields. But that is what will happen. And when you install and activate it, of course, it will be secure custom fields version 6.6.2 at the time of recording. So it will be basically the same as if you had updated or installed from new. So how do you get the normal ACF? Again, it's the same solution here. You go to the website. The link is in the video description. You go to the footer and you download ACF and that will stick 6.3.8 on your website. And each time WP Engine or whoever updates it, 
you can go and get it. Now, that does mean that you're going to manually do it. But however, if you keep up to date with what is happening in the world and whenever there is a new update, you should be OK. So what's my takeaway tip from all of this? If you've got an old version or a new version, I wouldn't bother hitting update. If I was you, I would just go to the website, get the 6.3.8 version and install that. If you've got ACF Pro, you don't need to worry. But look, anyone brand new or whatever, if you go and install it and you do get SCF, you can still use it. You can still use the custom fields and the custom post types and the taxonomies. So you could argue, well, I don't really care what the name is or where it's come from. I can use it. The only warning I want to put out there is that version 6.3.8 is the latest version. And that was released because uh, automatic informed WP engine that there was a security vulnerability. It was a very low risk security thing. OK. But WP Engine went and fixed it. And they even said thanks to Automatic when they did their release as well. It's literally in the change log. Go and have a look at it. But if you want the latest version, you're going to have to go to the Advanced Custom Fields website. If not, it's up to you. I cannot predict if it's OK to use 6.6.2, That's not for me to say. But some of you are going to be affected. OK, over 2 million websites have got active installation. You hit update, you're going to see SCF. You might not even have realized it, but it will do. If you want the latest updates, go and download directly from the website link. I'm Imran from Web Squadron. I hope you like, subscribe, share, and follow. I'll keep seeing you. Never break, always fight, never quit. Do it right, play the game, win it life. Have no shame, there's no time for the pain. You should be okay. One, two. Two, one, two, one, two, three, four, out of sync, out of sync, one, two, one, two, one, two, three, four. Nah, fucking delete that. Anyway, um,